Yes. Oh, no, 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 no. No, she can't. Did she kill? Oh, balls. Oh, balls. Oh, balls. Oh, balls. Oh, balls. I'm gonna die. Oh, what's the topor, guys? Oh, that worked. The upgrade worked. You guys are amazing. Greetings, guys and girls and fellow gamers. My name is Kim Sir Cakes and welcome back to Agaboration. Yes, it's been a couple of days. I finally finished my farm. Everything has been moved down and we can finally continue with some other things. I want to today do two things, definitely. The rest, I'm not sure what we're gonna do. It will always be made up as we go along. The tech saddle for, the, for our drakes we want to do and we want to play around with them. And we want to finally hatch our 468 Drake egg and see how beautiful this Drake looks and uh, how amazing it hopefully will be. We might actually be able to move the hatchery here on the top of the glass. We're gonna finish the glass roof as well. That would probably be a good idea to do that and uh, put the hatchery up there or something for the moment until we have everything sorted because that way I can move the hatchery thing and the nanny closer to the power supply and we don't have to worry about them being too far away because the power supply is still up here and i haven't really moved it yet anyway that's what we're going to do today and among other things hopefully either way i hope you guys are going to have a good time watching the episode if you do remember to kick that like button in the balls to support the channel and if you're new to the channel and you like what you see hit that subscribe button so let's get started now one of the things that i want to do straight up is i want to upgrade my rifle because you guys were saying that if i upgrade my rifle it will be much better like in, in applying more topor and quicker and faster to topor let's give it one more upgrade you failed to upgrade this item 10 percent of resources has been lost oh that's grand there we go ascendant so now after that is upgraded we want to obviously apply more damage or i don't know let's see actually what I, what do we have on blueprints all right so the durability is finished so let's do the damage first um here we go let's put the long neck in and we're just gonna leave the damage in and augment it one at a time look at that 424 446 that is four times five times 14 15 no it is maximum 700 very good and now we have five damage left so if we're gonna put the weapon durability in now where's the weapon durability there let's take that out so it doesn't try to do that it's weird that you can't tell it what you want it's, it's weird that you can't just drag and drop and like go boom 20 applied or whatever so here we go durability is going up now very nice i like it long range neck rifle now we create a blueprint of that bam now it takes it apart it makes a blueprint of it, but that's absolutely fine because what we're going to do now is we're going to click on that, get all the resources back. There we go. And craft. Did it craft it? All right. Yeah, I had to craft it at the smithy actually. Like, so sorry. I taught you connection crafted right there. So there was a bit of confusion there from on my behalf. Also, I have a crafted skill bonus of 25.3%, which now means the damage is 755.3 instead of 700. That is insane. So we're going to get an approximate area for the nursery up here. So I think this is big enough. I'm just going to leave this gap here so it can walk easily in and out. And it will be approximately... I would say one more. There we go. Two, three, whoops. There we go. Nice. And that is exactly opposite this one now. Nice, 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 nice. So now we can close this in. I think that will be enough. Oh, whoops. Have to do it from the outside to keep them pointing in the right direction. Now we might leave a little bit more of a gap and put like a door here or something like a double door. I don't know, something um, because it is to hold a drake. And I think this will be enough space to hold a drake. Let me see. Is this enough? Oh, I think it's enough. Yeah, it will be tight, but it should be enough. Yeah, maybe we'll make it a little bit wider. I'm making, I'm making more uh, ceilings. So maybe we make it a little bit wider up to about here where the door starts and bring it across here. I think that would be a good plan. Um, at least that way, we definitely have enough space in case we raise the walls and we want to actually close it in more. So we're making more walls here. There we go. Nice. 
I'm gonna leave this building in because you guys want to see it. A few comments have said I cut out too much, even though I, I think I met an, an okay balance, to be, to be fair. But um, let's leave some more in just to see how it goes. And you let me know in the comments, okay? So there we go. How do we, we go one more? Yeah, we leave that free so we can go into the elevator. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Dude, your tail. You're messing it all up. And he's on passive anyway, isn't he? Oh, he's neutral. No, 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 no. Dude, you have to be on passive. <laughs> oh, because the last thing I want is you going down there and causing havoc. You'd so have to be on passive. Genie Maca balls. Oh, yeah. There we go. Ah, you balls. <laughs> oh, that's one too much, actually. So let's take this one out. And there we go. I intentionally on either side left three so if you look at it here from the top now you can see this should be big enough for a nursery now our power supply is over there which is really really good so we might actually bring the power supply in but it means we should be able to place down the hatchery now anywhere in the corner i suppose or yeah let's put it in the corner and let's see what the um range on it is can we see the range Show range, I think it's big. I th yeah, look at that. It's going all the way past the base here. It's absolutely huge. It's definitely big enough. So um, let's turn that off. Let's turn the range, height range. There we go. And we can now put the nanny down as well, which I think has a huge range as well. So let's see the range on the nanny. Oh, yeah, 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 that's absolutely, that's actually, we should move a little bit more in the center, so she definitely encloses all of that. There we go. Now, I'm happy. I just wasn't happy with it not going past the corner. I just, I no, I couldn't live with myself. That was just not acceptable. Okay, so height range. Now, it should be very easy. We have our air conditioners. We're going to put them literally just here. Can we put them on the wall? No, they're not really going to snap. So why don't we just put them here right on the edge? There we go. And I think we only need three. There we go. And then once the egg actually is ready to go, we're just gonna pop it in front of this. And that's really it. So let's go and get the egg, which should be in here. Which one is it? Fertilize 260, 117, 130, 139, that's a 39, 39, 52. Ooh, where is it? Is it here? 468. There it is. Excellent. Okay. So theoretically, we should be able to just drop it here on the floor. No, not drop. Do we drop it on the floor or do we have to put it in here? I think. Is he not supposed to collect them automatically? Stop collecting. Activate, pick up hatchery, locked up, activate, activate. So he's active now because he's powered. She has to be active as well though. Activate, very good. And now we should be able to just drop this egg here and the dodo should be picking it up. Are you gonna pick it up? Because it is, it is too hot. Are you gonna pick it up? Why is he not picking it up? Okay, deactivate and activate. There we go. So now what we want to do is we need some nameless juice for the thing to grow up. So we are going to have to get a tech saddle for our, where's my other Drake? Down there. We have to get a tech saddle for our favorite Drake down there. Oh man, this is exciting. We actually can make the rock Drake tech saddle. That is so awesome. Oh man, you look so badass. Oh, we're gonna have to color that one. That looks pretty badass. I love it. Oh, the jaw on the bottom. We want that blue as well. 
The jaw on the bottom, we need that blue. There you go, nice, lovely. Okay, we have our hazmat suit on, we're ready to go. We even have some tech walls with us. Why, I have no idea. So let's go down. Oh, here's a nice plateau. So let's turn the light off. Oh, there's some Venator. And these guys gave me such a bloody hard time last time. Let's see what level they are. Maybe it's, wor oh no, that's, that's the wrong gun. Hang on, hang on. Balls, balls, balls. I need my spy class. Three twelve female. Oh, that would make for some very good entertainment. Oh, there we go. There's the nameless. Also, by the way, thank you so much for letting me know, guys, last time that the reason I was doing so little damage to the Reaper Queen was because I had the lights off. I didn't realize that. So there we go. Come on, pick up some some juice. Any juice? Did you leave any bags? No? Ooh, okay, no juice. Now, I really want to see what damage we do with our gun now that I have upgraded. I put the shotgun out, and with the shotgun, we should have full damage now. Would love to see how much damage that is, but I really want to nuke the 312 female. Really would like to... 31,000 Torpor. Holy balls. Okay, let's see what damage we have on this one. Oh, hello. Okay, okay, it's okay. Let's clear up a little bit. Well, we're always going to have Nameless or Seekers. So I, I just can't get past the loss of the Venator. I know you guys were saying, oh, bring back, uh, bring some walls with you and stuff like that. But in the end of the day, there's always a pack. And this pack is huge. I love the skin of this one. But the skin is, he's a crappy level. Yeah. Oh, well, he is. Yeah, he's too. Now, I want to have a 300 at least. 312. It needs to be a 312. So let's, let's, let's give it a shot. There we go. The 312 we don't want to damage. There we go. The 312 we don't want to damage. So I think we killed the other ones. Which one is the 312? Okay, he's dead. He can die. 312. Okay, these two can die. Yes! Oh, no, 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 no! No, she can't... Did she kill? Oh, balls! Oh, balls! Oh, balls! Oh, balls! Oh, balls! I'm gonna die. I'm actually not dead. Oh, my God. Okay, here we go. Come on! Come on! Kill it all! Come on! You can kill it! Okay, do we have the light off? Okay, I think we're okay. Holy balls. Okay, we're gonna need to get our Drake now. Come on, Drakey baby. Where are you? Which one is it? Which one is it? Sapphire? I think it's you. <sighs> okay, how are you doing on health? Oh, you're doing okay. Did you kill them all? Genie Mac, you probably did, didn't you? Let me see. Oh, you leveled up, so you probably did. Whew. That was scary, guys. I can't believe I fell off. I forgot to take you off. I was, like, taking my time killing them. That is terrible. Okay, we're gonna have to get back up there now. Okay, there's a 247 Venator over there. So I think if we aim at this guy, we should be able to separate them. Let me just see here. He's 26 and he's nearly dead. Did we get it? No. There we go. He's gonna be dead. There we go, he's dead. OK, 
Okay, is he the high level one? Oh, he's the low level one. Yes, okay, he's dead. So he's the high level one. Ah, no, jump! See, we want to get a good distance. So we can get a good shot at him. There we go, nice. Oh, what's the topo, guys? Oh, that worked! The upgrade worked! You guys are amazing! Okay, please don't die now. Please don't die. I don't even have a clue what we need. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I have nothing on me. No meat. Nothing. There we go. I'm gonna give you prime because I have no idea what you eat. Okay, let's um, put one of those in. Let's put the prime in and let's hope you eat prime. Okay, you do eat prime. That's good. Oh, nice. It's not the highest level, but it's mine. Oh, yeah. Oh, I love you, man. Look at you and you're nice and green. Oh, you're amazing. And you can be enabled to wander. That is awesome, guys. This is our first Venator. Oh, my. Oh, we don't need a saddle for him. Are you kidding me? Okay, Sapphire, you're going to have to follow me. So let's take it home. And then hopefully both of them will come with me now. <laughs> I hope. Yes. Oh, that is awesome. You're 370. You are beautiful. So let's see what your stats are. Wow, you already have a lot of points. You're pretty even. You have a lot of points, pretty even, Stevens. Okay, we can craft a primitive Venator implant. So, uh, seeing that we don't need a saddle, I'm assuming this is basically um, acting like a saddle according to the description. So, it says that... Let me see here. Primitive implant. Equip this implant onto a Venator. Provides are more similar to a saddle. Excellent. So, can you see it? Is it visible? I don't think so. But you know what we definitely need for this guy? We definitely need for this guy is um, a dino tracker <laughs> and um, he's not max level guys he's not max level but you know what guys I would be absolutely honored if you guys would would like to give him a name I mean just look at him absolutely awesome and we're gonna get into cloning very soon I think the next episode we're gonna focus on cloning and we're gonna play around with it because our Drake, the big one that's gonna come up, um, probably not in this episode because we're gonna have to actually let it grow and feed and imprint and all that, um, we're gonna have to give it a name and we're gonna have to clone it. So this guy here, if you would love to give it a name, I would be absolutely honored guys, I would, I would love it. Here you go, a little bit of inspiration for you guys, just look at this lovely, lovely beast. Nice. Isn't, isn't it, is, is it a he or she? Let me see. He or she. It's a female. A lovely girl that needs a name. She's just a girl standing in front of a dino wanting to eat its heart out. <laughs> oh man, poo flying everywhere. So that is pretty amazing. I like it. So do we get a thousand? Yes. Beautiful. You can actually dump all that. Except the arrows. I do like to keep the arrows actually because they can can make things out of them and you might want to actually hang on to some meat okay so now that you're ready to go and the name will be hopefully picked for you let's go and check out the egg oh let's go to the nanny 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 you're activated let's give that to our nanny there you go nameless juice nice let's take the egg lovely and let's put it here. You guys are ready? You guys are ready? You guys are ready? Don't eat. Don't eat. Drop. Oh, look at this. And it's not too hot. It's incubating. It's beautiful. It's perfect. Four, six, eight. Oh, it's a green one. It's another green one. Oh, you're so beautiful. Let's disable wandering. Oh, no. Imprint. We have to do the imprinting. There we go. You guys give it a name. Okay, so I need you guys to give me a name for a male, oh, a male rock trake. We might have to do some potions, guys, to make them. Oh, can we do? 
I think there's something in the S plus we can make them have babies because this is a male and Sapphire is a girl. Please be a girl. Yes! Oh, that would be so amazing. Oh, hey! Hey! <laughs> okay, no more wandering for you. Behavior, disable wandering. But here, come with me, okay? Come with me, little dude. Okay, come on. Come on. You're not coming. Why are you not coming? Come on. I'm gonna go all the way over here, look. There you go, nice. Look at you. And you stand right here. We're gonna put you all the way over here. And that way you have enough room to grow. You gonna come? There you go, lovely. That's where you can stay. Okay, you stay right here. Nice, no wandering, nothing. You stay right here. We're gonna put a post down and actually hitch you to it, which should help. There you go, hitching post. Excellent. So we're gonna put the hitching post here and that should be close enough. There you go, nice. Lovely. All right, good look. You should be looked after now. Your imprinting should actually start very soon. It should be going 1% uh, already. Excellent stuff. Look at you. She is looking after you. Do we need more nameless juice? I don't know. I can get a few more just, just to be safe. Can we split them? No, we can't. Okay, but they're only going like once every hour and 20. That's fine. And you are going to be finished in about... Probably three to four hours. So this is not going to happen in this episode. There you go. We need a name for our male green emerald colored dragon. Give me a hint. Emerald. I oh, know. Emmy. I don't know. And we need definitely a name for our female Venator. That was an absolute lucky tame. I said, screw it. Not fussed about level. Let's just do it to get one. And then we can always go for a big one afterwards. We're going to have to play around with her as well. Anyway, I'm going to leave this episode here, guys. I hope you had fun with the episode. I know it was a little bit here and there and a little bit mixed and match. It's just very hard to plan these things ahead, you know, when you don't know really what is going to happen. That's what I love about Ark. It's a bit, it's a bit unpredictable, and it's very, <laughs> but it makes it very hard to upfront plan what you're going to do. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, remember to kick that like button in the balls, and I hope I see you guys in the next episode. And if you're new to the channel and you like what you see, hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you guys next time. Until then, as always, feel spaz and happy gaming. So this Venator is actually pretty awesome. I mean, if you if you look at this guy, yeah, he's absolute badass looking, like a Reaper, only a little bit smaller. And he has the standard attack here. He has a tail swipe attack, which is absolutely badass if you look at it from the top. And then he also has this. Look at this. Let's turn around. Let's go here. Bam! Look at this. Do you see that? That is absolutely amazing. He can actually pick things up with his tongue in its mouth and then keep them there. Even when he screams. <laughs> he has a roar. Oh man. And with the tail swipe, he actually hits the tag it hits the enemy in his mouth as well, which is unbelievable. Which is awesome. But anyway, some of the coolest things actually that this guy does is he's also a resource collector. Look at this. He collects stone, and that's the other swipe, the other tail swipe. He collects more flint than stone. So I wonder if he also collects metal. Now here we see that he actually collects more thatch than wood. So it's a thatch and flint collector. Now he's an absolute awful swimmer. So if we go around here, it's only for a little bit, so it's gonna be okay. There's a resource node here, so let's see if he actually can get metal as well. Oh, nice! So it's a metal collector as well. That is so cool! Oh, whoa, whoa, you are beautiful!